In this video, we'll be creating a patrolling enemy AI. So to start out, we'll create a script. Call it enemy AI patrol. Once you've done that, go ahead and open it up. Once you have the script open, go ahead and clean it up. We'll start out by creating some variables. First one will be a transform array. All the waypoints. Next one will be a float. Call it speed. Next one will be a int variable, an int integer variable. Call it current waypoint. After that, create a boolean variable. Call mine do patrol. And set it to true by default. The next few are going to be vector threes. First one is called target. The next one will be our move direction. And the last one will be our velocity. After that, we'll create our update function. And here we'll first check if our current waypoint is less than the length of our waypoints array. If it is, target will equal waypoints cure waypoint that position. So this is setting the target to the current waypoint. Our move direction we target minus our current position and the velocity will be rigid body dot velocity. Then we will check if move direction dot magnitude is less than one. If it is Cure point plus plus. If not, then our velocity equals move direction dot normalized times speed. And then move on down. So if our current waypoint is less than, or I mean, our current waypoint is greater than the length of our waypoints. Then I will check if do patrol is true. If it is, current waypoint is zero. Basically resetting it. If not, then our velocity is going to be set to zero. Which would be Vector 3.0. And after that if statement, we'll set our rigid body velocity to the velocity variable. And we'll make this object look at our target. Once you have all that, go ahead and save it and we'll go test it out. Now to test it out, we'll have to create a few game objects. First one we'll create will be our enemy. We'll name it enemy. Then we'll need to create our waypoints. Now we'll use spheres. Go ahead and get an overhead view. We have one there. One there. And one there. I will rename these as well. Waypoint 1. Waypoint 2 and waypoint 3. A little more. There. And we'll also need to turn off the collider on all these. Now, our enemy, we'll need to add a rigid body to them and take off use gravity since we're not going to be using gravity. And Add in our patrol script. 
waypoints, we have three of them, so set three to the size and drag in your waypoints. And speed, I'll put 10. And to get that, go ahead and press play. So you can see our enemy is going through each of the waypoints, making it appear as he is a tro patrolling. Slow him down. Give him a nice slow patrol. And with that, you have successfully created a patrolling enemy AI.